Hello and welcome to this Themify screencast. Today I'm going to be showing you a quick tour of the new Themify Builder, a drag and drop content builder for WordPress. Using Builder to build your site how you want it is really easy to do and over the next couple of minutes I'm going to show you exactly how it works. So here I've got a page set up, Builder, and I've used the Themify custom panel to select no sidebar. You'll see I haven't got any content on the page, but that's all about to change. So if I scroll down and click on Page Builder, this is where the Themify Builder lives, and using this drag and drop interface, you can really easily add a load of content onto your pages. So let's show you how it works. I'm going to start off by adding a text module. So to add a module, I just need to click on the Add button, and you will see this brings up a modal box where I can add in my content. So I'll just paste in some dummy content here and click Save. And now that's added. Next, to add an image to the next module, I just need to click on the image button. And now I just need to upload the image I want. And now I can add a title and a caption. And now I just need to click save. And I can just repeat this process for all the content I want. So if I want a video, I will just add in a video here and embed it by just pasting the URL and I will add the video title here as well and save that and finally if I want to add say a map I just need to drag and drop and then I can type in the address of the place I want so I'll just go for London UK I can set the width and the height and insert that. And now I've created my first builder content. The customization doesn't stop there though. You can use these columns here and you can stack different bits of content just by dragging and dropping. You can change the widths of each of your columns. So now I have three equal widths, for example. And if I want to move any of this content around, all I need to do is just drag and drop it. If I want to add another row, all I need to do is click Add New Row, and again, I can just drag and drop the content from either adding new content or existing content I've already added, and just drag and drop that, and I can say, make this map full width. If I want to duplicate some content I've already added, I just need to click the Duplicate button. If I want to get rid of some content I've already added, I just need to click the Delete button. So now I'll save this, just by clicking the Save button and view it on my site. And on the site itself, you can really see how the module system works. You're probably thinking then, wouldn't it be cool if you could edit your content and use the builder from the front end on your actual site? Well, the good news is you can. If you just need to hover over the WordPress menu and click Turn on Builder, and now you have all the options you had in the back end. So as before, I can drag content around, I can move the rows, and any one of these modules I can duplicate, delete, or move around. It really is genuinely drag and drop. If I want to edit any of my content, then all I need to do is just hover over and click the pencil button, and it brings up the same editing tools as before. So here I can just get rid of that last sentence. Save, and now that's done. As well as editing and moving your content around from the front end, you can also add new content. So for example, I might want to add a post, and to do that, I just need to drag and drop the post module. It brings up this box, and I can set the options I want. So I'll go for the category Featured, have two posts, and I'll display excerpts, and you can set all these options. And I'll save that. And now you see I have those two posts displaying. So say let's make that half width and make this other one half width and now I can add in say a slider just by dragging and dropping I'll go for the category photos here and display three photos I have no excerpt let's just go for the images and save and now I have this slider below the slider say let's add a divider and we'll just go for a dotted divider and add that in 
And now we'll add in, say, a testimonial. Another video. And I can just embed that straight off Vimeo. Give the video width 100%. Add that in. I'm just adding content here just to show you how easy it is to use. Um, let's add in another divider here. Um, same dotted one. And finally, we'll just go for a menu. And here I can choose any of the menus I've created in the WordPress dashboard. And there we go. Save. And here you can see in only a couple of minutes I've built my whole site layout. I've got all these modules here and all these columns which I can drag around to customize. So say if I wanted to move this section to the top, all I need to do is drag it and then drop it and you'll see all that content's moved. I've stacked all this content, so if I want to move any of it around, I can do. I just need to drag and then drop it in. To say I want to move that text further up, I can do that, just drag and drop. And then when I'm done customizing, all I need to do is hover over Themeify Builder, turn off Builder, and now that's saved onto my site and my visitors will be able to see that. And that's just a quick overview of how the Themeify Builder works. This thing is really great. It allows you to customize your content and get your site looking how you really want it. You're not stuck with pre-built content or pre-built templates. You can just build your own, and that's really great. Hopefully this has been of some help to you, and thank you very much for watching.